start in February, uh, but I don't particularly want to leave you know, before then, really. So uh, I, I'm going to be pretty evasive, but I think that uh, you know, the topic that I, I you know, spoke about, your know, convergence, you know, where Scotland's support uh, uh, levels are compared to the rest of Europe is, is a critical one. Uh, and the UK government did get a, an uplift of funding, uh, about 45 million you know, from Europe, because uh, the UK budget on average was lower than that of Europe. That didn't actually come to Scotland, it was spread about the UK on you know, a historical basis, and that, that went down pretty badly. And it's, it's raised the temperature up you know, quite a lot, and I think it is part of the referendum debate. You know, are we going to get a better deal negotiating for ourselves and being a member state, or are we going to be a, 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 you know, a, a, a better within the UK? Uh, and and, and that, that is a really live debate. I think the other part of the coin is that uh, your representation, the reality is that Scotland does have a food and drink policy. We have an economy which is you know, far more geared to food and drink. Uh, and, and a real investment in that, not just from our present administration, but you know, generally from the Scottish, the Scottish uh, 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 MSPs. And that, that, that's a very different place from where England is. And if you look at part of your regions like uh, Orkney, you know, I think 11, 12, 14% of their economy is actually directed from agriculture. Uh, Dumfries and Galloway are the same. If you look at the UK, it's, it's between 1% and 2%. Uh, Scotland's about 2 So you know, a very big difference. And I think direct <coughs> representation is attractive. The converse, or the other part of it, is that we've talked about export markets and how important Europe is. But in reality, England's one hell of a lot more important to Scotland. Scotland is a net producer of uh, food. Uh, all our sectors are net exporters. But the reality is our big market is England. Uh, and do you want to uh, uh, you know, exclude yourself from a British logo uh, by being independent on that? Again, is something that farmers are grappling with. Does it matter whether it's a Saltire or a Union Jack if it's in Tesco's in, uh, or, or Asda in, 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 uh, in Preston? You know, and, and, uh, these are things we're arguing about. Um, I, I'm not sure, you know, it's, 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 a, it's a really live debate, and I think it's a debate we have to have. Um, I'm looking forward to being over. The reality is it's really important we do have it, and I think it has excited people in Scotland, but we've, we've got to actually make a decision, and then whatever we do, we've got to bloody make it work. We've got to forget about being divided. If you look around the world, being divided and fighting about things isn't a very clever thing to do, and the debate in Scotland has been done in a very civilised way, I think the, the, the real win will be you know, if we can actually unite together and make whatever settlement we decide on work, and we've got to do that.